Shalom, Shalom, Akiyam. First and foremost, I would like to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baha Shem, Rakakwadash. I would also like to give a double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, where I learned this 144% truth. I would also like to say peace and salutations to the hopeful elect scattered throughout all four corners of this earth. It's just Bayan back again through the spirit and power of Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai. And I just wanted to get into a few scriptures and Lord willing, I'll share this quick clip with you, Akiyam and Akwaf. Pretty much, you know, going into the folly of Israel. You know, I'm sure uh, most of you Akiyam and Akwath have witnessed the uh, the slap, you know, Will Smith, you know, put on Chris Rock at the uh, at the Oscar Awards, I, I believe. But needless to say, it's all folly, man. And all it is, it, it's being used to create uh, a distraction. You see? Because at the end of the day, man, you know, here it is. You got all these... Um, variables coming together, you know, as far as uh, food inflation, you know, you got, you know, propane is depleting, gasoline, okay, you got these crops, you know, that are, that are, that are languishing, famine is imminent, you got your president talking about, talking about uh, food shortages, man, you know, you know, all this turmoil going on, you know, all over the world. But then again, everyone's focus is on Will Smith slapping Chris Rock. And if you ask me, it was fake. It was all staged, man. Because again, it, it's being used to create distraction. You know, because you Jake are simple. You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans are simple. And you love drama. You love to be entertained. And your focus is not on what it needs to be on. It's not focused on the truth. It's not focused on the times that are at hand. Where you are in imminent danger, man. And you don't even know it. You know, so through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. I just want to share this clip with you, Akiyama and Akwath, real quick. But before I get that, let's get... Uh, Let's get first Maccabees real quick. The book of first Maccabees. Chapter one and verse 11. And it reads in those days went there out of Israel wicked men. Right. And these actors and actresses and athletes and all these all these so-called Negroes, Latinos and Native Americans that, that have a so-called uh you know, a constellation on this side, right? They, they're, they're joined to the wicked, man. They're joined to the enemy. You see, they're not for their people. They're for the agenda of the enemy. Okay? And these are the same spirits from the days of old. Okay, that, that, that joined the enemy then. That was contrary to, to their own people then, man. You know, because whether you believe it or not, reincarnation is a real thing. We're all ancient spirits. Reincarnation's in the scriptures. You know, so these, these wicked niggas, you know, at this Oscar Awards, all of them, all of them, man. Denzel Washington, Will Smith, Chris Rock. All right, Michael, Joe, all these wicked niggas, man. Hey, they're all against, they're all for Esau, Edom, the so-called white man, and they are against their people. They're enemies to Israel, man. Let me continue on. The book of 1 Maccabees, chapter 11, and verse 11, and it reads, Salakia, 1 Maccabees, chapter 1, and verse 11, and it reads, in those days went there out of Israel wicked men who persuaded many, saying, 
let us go and make a covenant with the heathen that are round about us. For since we departed from them, we have had much sorrow, right? Same greedy niggas. You know, they only want to feed their belly. They'll bend over backwards for Esau, man. They'll they'll touch their ankles, man, and, and be abused and, and, and defiled, degraded. Hey, just to get a crumb off this devil's table, man. But they're going to have to pay for these things. You know, because they're causing you, Jake, that look up to these wicked niggas and these wicked women of Israel. Hey, you're being led to the slaughter. You see? So through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahshua, let me share this clip with you, Aki Aminakwath, real quick. Jada says she's not coming. Protesting. I'm like, is, is she on a TV show? <laughs> Jada's going to boycott the Oscars. Jada boycotting the Oscars is like me boycotting Rihanna's panties. <laughs> I wasn't invited. And at the end of the day, man, it was all staged. It was all staged, man. Those are two uh, seasoned actors man if there's one thing they know how to do <laughs> they know how to act you see but again it's just to lead you jake astray man to get your distraction off what needs to be focused on and that's the devil that the bible speaks of esau edom the so-called white man and everything that's happening around the world you know you jake a simple you enjoy these type of things, man. Hey, but what you don't understand is that these actors and actresses and athletes and these so-called uh, we made it, Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, hey, they're joined to the enemy, man. They're touching pitch. You see? You know what? Let's get that. Let's go. That's uh, Ciroc. Sirach The book of Ecclesiasticus Also known as the book of Sirach Chapter 13 And verse 1 And it reads He that toucheth pitch Shall be defiled therewith And what is pitch? Let's look it up Let's get it real quick Let's get it in the Miriam. Pitch. Pitch, all right. It's a black or dark viscous substance obtained as a residue in the distillation of organic materials and especially tars. You see? So pitch is it's icky and sticky. It's hard to get it off you. Okay? And who's that pitch? That's Esau eating the so-called white man. And let's prove it. Let's go back to the scripture. The book of Ecclesiasticus, also known as the book of Sirach, chapter 13 and verse 1, and it reads, He that toucheth pitch shall be defiled therewith, and he that hath fellowship with a proud man, see, Shall be like unto him. And this is your leaders, man. You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Your leaders, the, 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 the wicked niggas. All right? The wicked nigger, Latino, and Native Americans you look up to. The so-called Negro, Latinos, and Native Americans. Okay? Because they're just wicked Israelites. Right? But you simple Jake. 
look up to these people, man. Not realizing they're defiled, man. Why? Because they're they're joined to the proud man. And Esau, Edom, the so-called white man, is coined in the scriptures as being the most proud. And these 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 wicked so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans that you simple Jake like to follow and look up to, guess what? They're leading you to the slaughter. You know, let's prove that. Let's go get that in the book of uh, Isaiah. Yeah, wake up, Jake. This is our stage, man. Don't lose sight on what's happening, man. The book of Isaiah, chapter 9, and verse 16, and it reads, For the leaders of this people cause them to err. You see, and that error goes into error. And what's going to happen? And they that are led of them are destroyed. See? Are you following behind these? You know, we we made it, you know, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, man. You simple, Jake. Hey, you're going to be destroyed following behind them, man. Because you got to follow Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. These people are evil, man. They're joined to the devil, man. Scripture says we are to hate the evil and love the good. You see? Scripture also specifies that the fear of the Lord is to hate evil. You see? These people don't hate evil, man. They're joined to it. You know, let's get that. Let's get that in um, Proverbs. Proverbs, the 8th chapter. In the 13th verse, and it reads, The fear of the Lord is to hate evil. See? Man, if you really knew what these so-called actors and actresses and athletes and, you know, your so-called, uh, you know, successful Negro, so-called Negro, Latino, Native American, if you knew the things that they've done and the things that they do, it'll, it'll be a shame to speak of the things that they do in secret, man. Why? Because they're joined to the devil that the Bible speaks of, man. Continuing on, pride and arrogancy and the evil way and the forward mouth do I hate. You see, and these so-called successful Jake are all these things, man. They're pride, they're arrogant. You see, they're choosing the evil way. Why? Because they're choosing the way. Of the oppressor. And scripture says. Envy not the oppressor. And choose none of his ways. And they have a froward mouth. And that word froward. Pretty much goes into disobedient. You know. Or opposition to man. And Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahweh Shai. Hates that man. This is why it will behoove you. To, to, to detach. You know, from these type of people, man. You know, because I know there's plenty of you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, you know, that are listening to the to the men of the Lord. You know, you're following the word. But then again, you're also looking into other things, man. You know, you're looking into other things, which is easily taking your attention away from this truth. You got to be focused. You got to be tunnel vision with this word. You got to be all in. You can't get distracted, you know? And all this is is sorcery, man. This is witchcraft. You know what they're doing with, with that whole Will Smith smacking Chris Rock bullshit, man. <laughs> because now you're going to have all these radio stations talking about it. It's probably going to be on new, on the news if it, if, it, if it wasn't already. You see, and the news, their media, all that, what's that going to? Medium, Okay. 
which goes into witchcraft, man. And this is all this is to cause distraction and, and to pretty much throw up a smoke screen to what's really going on. <laughs> you know? These people, at the end of the day, they're through. You know, they're not worth looking up to, man. They're through. You know? You got this man up there crying. You know, crying over over his success in Babylon the Great. But here it is. This place is going to be burnt to nothing. These people are, uh, Scripture guilt goes into it. They're, they're, they're striving for a... Uh, what is it? For a corruptible crown, man. You know what? Let's close out there. They're not worth looking up to, man. Um, let's get the... Kind of, let's close out here. Through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. The book of 1 Corinthians chapter 9 and verse 25. And it reads, And every man that striveth for the mastery is temperate in all things. Right? And that word temperate pretty me pretty much goes into, you know, um uh being being um serious, you know. They put their all into it, man. You know? They're putting their all into it. You know? Now they do it to obtain a corruptible crown. Right? Because everything on this side is not going to make it. You see? It's going to be destroyed upon the return of our Lord, Yahweh Shai. Right? Continuing on. But we... A so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans in this truth, pushing this world with all our might and all our soul, right? An incorruptible crown. <laughs> and Lord willing, we're part of that precious number. You see, but the point, the point I'm making is, you know, these, you know, so-called celebrities and, you know, so-called successful Jake, you know, they're wicked, man. You know, they're wicked because they're joined unto the wicked. And what scriptures say? Though hand join in hand, the wicked shall not go unpunished. Roughly paraphrasing. You see? And they're, they're going to get thrust through with these niggas, with these devils, man. They're going to get thrust through with them. Hey, because they're joined with them. The judgment that's coming to this earth is for the wicked. And if you're joined unto the wicked... You're going to be thrust through Isaiah 13 and 15. Don't envy these, these disposable, you know, um, wicked, completely, you know, defiled, so-called successful Jake, man. Follow Yahweh Bashim Yahushai with all your heart, with all your soul. You know, put off this world. You know, focus on the kingdom to come. Hey, because this place is going to be destroyed, man. All praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakak, Wadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles of the Great Millstone, where I learned this 144% truth. Lord willing, you Akiyam and Akwaf were edified. Barakatha Yahweh. Barakata Yahweh Shai, Barakata Yahweh, Barakata Yahweh Shai, Barakata Yahweh, Barakata Yahweh Shai, Kal Halalim La, Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakak Wadash, Shalom Akiyam.